Over the past few years, we've seen examples of good governance and bad governance in the public blockchain space. Good governance has created thriving communities. Bad governance has created arguments, divided communities, and ultimately people just cut adrift, not being able to be paid or incentivized to contribute to those communities. In the Bitcoin Ethereum communities, we've seen some examples of bad governance that have divided those communities and led people to create forks in chains and sometimes exposing areas of the communities and subjecting them to 51% attacks. In other cases, developers have not been incentivized. In the case of Zcash, the developer wanted to fork the chain because he wasn't being paid. In 2019, a number of enterprises will be productionizing their blockchain applications. For this, they're gonna need new governance to cope with decentralized technology, and this will mean some different business models. A blockchain technology world, we will be sharing what we have learned from the public blockchains and their governance. And I'll be telling us how we can think about a new set of business models with strong governance and incentivization to assure enterprises of all shapes and sizes can get the best out of enterprise blockchain.